Hair rash are not only meant to dry your hair, but they can also improve your hair health. So welcome back guys to the best place for latest tech review and concept trender. This is Hinaldi Technology and in today's video, we are going to compare the Dyson Supersonic and Life in Swift Hair Dryer. Dyson is one of the most leading brands when you talk about hair dryers and recently Life has launched their Swift Hair Dryer which is offering almost the same features in less price than the Dyson Supersonic. Both the hair dryers have almost similar look, both comes with the user manual and their separate magnetic nozzle attachments. Lifen comes with a total of 3 different attachments, standard concentrator, a diffuser and a quick styling nozzle. Whereas the Dyson comes with 5 different attachments, a styling concentrator, gentle air attachment, a diffuser, smoothening nozzle and a flyaway attachment. Along with that, it also comes with detangling comb, paddling brush and a presentation case. The diffuser disperses air evenly to reduce frizz. This is the perfect attachment if you have curly hairs or you want the wavy look. The gentle hair attachment is recommended for the ones who have fine hairs and sensitive scalps. About the flyaway attachment, this glides on your hair and minimizes little flyaways which makes the hair smooth and shiny. The presentation case protects and neatly stored your dryer and its attachments. Lifen has an ergonomic and user-friendly design which reduces burdens on hand and is extremely lightweight. It weighs around 1.03 pounds. Whereas the Dyson weighs slightly more that is 1.09 pounds. Both the products have an air intake filter which brings in clean air for hygienic air output. Here on the Dyson, it has a physical latch that locks into one specific point. Whereas on Lifen, it is a magnetic snap on and off type which doesn't require any specific location to be locked. Apart from this while using the Lifen, the finger rotates the bottom part which a kind of feels like it is not locked which is not in the case of Tyson. Both the hair are have their maximum motor speed of 1 lakh 10,000 rotation per minute. Even having so high speed, both of them produce very less noise. The reason behind so high speed is that it dry out your wet hair 50% faster than a regular dryer. Now let's talk about the buttons. As you can see there has enough total of 4 buttons, the on and on switch, the on and off switch, the cold shut button, temperature control button and airflow control buttons. This has 3 speed settings, low for diffusing, medium for regular drying, high for fast drying and styling and 4 different heat settings 100 degree fast drying and styling 80 degree for regular drying 60 degree for gentle drying and 28 degree for constant cold the cold shut button directly switch your temperature to 28 degree celsius for constant cooling as the Dyson has 4 buttons Lifen has only 2 of them the one is a combined switch of air flow and the power on and off switch and the other is of temperature control. The combined switch make it more easy and quicker to go to your preferred air flow settings. They only have two air flow settings, low and high. It also has thermal control technology which will protect your hair from getting damaged from extreme heat. Apart from this, it also has an auto shut off feature which will shut it off if the temperature is too hot. And the another is a temperature control button. And the main cool thing is that you get an LED indicator at the back of your hair dryer which will indicate the temperature of air flow and which is super easy to understand. It will indicate in blue color for cool air, yellow color indicating warm air at 50 degrees celsius and red will indicate hot air at 80 degrees celsius. Here the Dyson lags in indicating the temperature of the air flow. Now let's talk about the price. As you have seen, the Lifen is giving almost a similar feature as of the Dyson, that too in half of its price, the Dyson will cost you around $400. Obviously the Dyson has precise temperature control setting and also very different type of attachment for various hair situation. If you are looking out for a good quality hair dryer, but you don't want to invest too much in it, we will suggest you to go for Lifen. If you don't have any budget issue and you want a professional hair dryer, then we will suggest you to go for the Dyson Supersonic. 
So this was about the comparison between the Lifewin and the Dyson hair dryers. I hope you liked this video. If so, do hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and also do let us know in the comments down below which hair dryer will you choose. This is an old technology, and we will catch you guys in the next one. Till then, peace out.